and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to show you something that my husband and I ordered a couple weeks ago and it finally arrived last Saturday and I am so happy that we picked this out. Today I'm going to be talking about our new bed. Not a sponsored video but I wanted to show you what we purchased recently. Quite a few months ago we have been needing a bed so we have had our mattress for quite a few years, long overdue. We didn't do it, we just kept waiting and the last couple months I would say um, my husband was complaining about back pain. It wasn't really bothering me at first and then probably the last month or two my back has been extremely painful. My sunk in every time we would lay. It was so uncomfortable. We would toss, we would turn, so quality of sleep was horrible. Um, we weren't sleeping well. Um, waking up pretty crabby, just um, not sleeping well at all. So it's just really uncomfortable. So finally we decided to get out there and start looking at beds. Now just the thought of looking at beds was so overwhelming. So I knew right away we did not want like a bed in a box. Um, certain brands we wanted to stay away from we just weren't really interested in. We did go to about six different furniture places to look at beds. Furniture. So we went to Becker, we went to Slumberland, we went to Ashley, we went to Home, we went to Mattress Firm, and we went to the Sleep Number store. So I reached out to people that had some Sleep Number beds. We we're actually looking at purchasing a Sleep Number bed. We went into the store. And then after reading a lot of comments from people and seeing photos they didn't have for even three years, we decided we didn't want a sleep number bed. And I know for some people they absolutely love it and that's great. I'm glad that works for you. We just didn't want to um, get a sleep number. And then we tried the purple mattress which I just thought was really spongy. I didn't feel it was really comfortable so um, I don't think my husband really cared for it either. So I said that's not for us. So I know everybody has their own preference on their mattress and how firm they like it. Some like it firm, some don't. Um, some are side sleepers, back sleepers, stomach sleepers, so it really just depends on preference. And when I laid on the purple mattress, it was just not for us. The next bed that we tried was the Beauty Rest. Now, I know somebody that has a Beauty Rest bed, and it's a very nice bed. We tried it out, and oh my gosh, right away, Brian and I just kind of knew, oh my gosh, this is so comfortable, and we both loved it. But we were going to keep looking at beds because I didn't want to just lay on it and say it was comfortable, not be happy with the purchase. So we went and looked at more beds. So we tried a lot of beds. We went back and tried them out again and again and again just because we wanted to make sure. So we kept going back to the beauty rest, and there were some that weren't, but we had picked one out that we both really liked. Anyways, after trying countless mattresses and lots of questions, um, we decided, let me tell you, we have needed sleep for months now. Like, no kidding. We have been tossing, turning, back pain, everything. Uh, we've needed this bed for so long. So we finally decided on picking out the beauty rest with the adjustable base. You know, just the first two nights of sleeping on this. Wow, what a huge difference. The first night was amazing. Like, we were sleeping in pretty much like a big sunken hole because the mattress was so old. It was literally just, it needed to be replaced and it definitely affects your back, your body, your sleep, um, everything. Like, I was moody every day because I was not getting any sleep. Brian was not getting any sleep. Like, it was miserable at that point. And actually, on the last day, before my bed was delivered on Saturday, um, we decided we didn't want to sleep on this mattress anymore. Like, it was done. I'd rather sleep on the floor. And we actually hauled it out onto the porch. And I said, they can pick it up. I'm not even going to sleep one more night since it's coming tomorrow at 8 a.m. So that's what we did. Um, we hauled it out. And believe me, it was in bad shape. It was just terrible. So I'm glad we didn't even sleep on it another night. Took it out there. We slept on the couches. And that was fine. Also, the pillow and the bed sheets and everything that I showed today, none of it is sponsored. I just want to put that out there. So they definitely said to get a mattress protector, and so that's what we did. We got a mattress protector. It was about a hundred bucks. It's a very nice bed, so I wanted it to be taken care of. My mom was really nice enough to buy us our first bed sheets. Thanks, mom. So $235. They were 40% off. We love them. They're really nice. My mom also purchased our pillows for my birthday gift. So they were over $100. We picked out two of them. So I'm going to move over here so you can actually see it. So this is the bed gear. Um, this is mine. This is the 3.0. Then Brian had picked out the 2.0. Now, 
I was not sure, like, you know, when you try pillows at the store, everything's really comfortable, but you don't sleep on it for days or a week, and then you find out, uh, maybe it's not as comfortable. So I will say the first couple days, I was not impressed with the pillow. My neck hurt, but I usually sleep on flat pillows. My husband loves to sleep propped up with 50 pillows, but I am definitely opposite of that. So um, for me, my neck hurt the first two nights, but now... Um, I love this pillow like it is one of my favorites like I can't sleep without this pillow now um, it's wonderful so the nice thing about this is it has a zip off washable cover on the pillow so just take it off and throw it in the washer so it's really nice but these are the bed gear um, this is a 3.0 we have the 3.0 and the 2.0 so um, we each had picked one out another thing that I noticed right away in the store was how high the bed is like really high up versus my old bed. So now Brian is six foot two. I'm 4'11", so it's quite a few inches off the ground for me to get up on the bed. And I am short, so any bed is kind of high, but this bed is really high. Like, I'd have to, like, really get on my tiptoes to get up on this bed. We also decided on getting a king-size bed. So my last bed was a queen size, and my bedroom is quite large so it is made for a king size bed so the queen size bed looked really silly in this room and of course where the outlets are they were really far away because it wasn't a king size bed so now the outlets are closer to the bed and it looks really nice but this is the king size adjustable base some of the features that i really like about this bed besides it adjusts it's really comfortable like i don't want to get out of this bed ever my husband doesn't want to get out of bed because it's so comfortable. We look forward to going to bed now. So one feature that we really like is the massage. So, oh my gosh, amazing feature. And I love it. It is so relaxing. And I do have like a little waterfall in my bedroom that plays music, plays loons. It's just has thunder and it. And with the massage feature, it is just you f literally just fall right to sleep. It's amazing. Um, the other feature that it has is it has a lumbar support. Another feature that it has, it has lights on under the bed. So I already used this feature more than once. Drop something under the bed, I can't see anything under there. So hit the lights and I can see under my bed. So it came in really handy. I really didn't think that I would like that feature and I actually told them like I don't need anything with lights and I know they have like um, plug-ins on beds now. Like I didn't need all that but it came with it. Another great feature that they have is the if you can see it, it's probably blurry, sorry, but it is the snore button. So my husband snores once in a while, um, drives me nuts. So when he's snoring, I can just hit that snore button and so it will adjust the bed either way and he hasn't snored since I've pressed that button. It's been great. So it also has the zero gravity button. It is a beautiful bed. I couldn't believe how big it is. I've never had a king size bed. Um, another thing, if you notice behind me, I do not have a headboard. I've never owned a headboard. I don't know why, I just didn't. So this nice bed, we are getting a headboard. And I'm really looking at like a nice gray one. Very beautiful bed. But anyways, that is our bed. I will show you it. The quality of our sleep has been so much better. I've never slept so well in my life. And at some point, I will get a king size comforter, minor all queen, because that's what I had, but we will get one. But we have our bed sheets. They are deep pocket bed sheets. We looked at so many beds, so I know it's just about preference and what we like. And again, it's kind of what everyone finds comfortable. And you really have to try out lots of beds. But if you have a sleep number bed or a purple mattress or a Casper and you love those beds, then great. Do what works for you. We love this bed and it worked for both Brian and I. I cannot say enough positive things about this bed. If you have any questions about the bed, feel free to leave them in the comments below. This is the King Size Beauty Rest Hybrid with the adjustable base. And if you've never really seen a adjustable bed, I will show you what it does. Also, I know that some beds has a... Um, dual frame so if Brian wants to raise his head up I can stay flat we decided on going with one single frame um, so if I adjust it Brian's going up with me hasn't been an issue at all um, reason is the beauty rest does not make one um, I know I've seen like a split top um, and they do not have it so it would be a split all the way down the center of the bed which we did not want so 
this is what we picked because we picked the beauty rest. Anyways, that's what we've been doing. We've been getting ready to get our bed in and we finally got our bed in. Such a big difference on comfort and sleep. We're getting lots of rest. We've been dragging for the last month, just super exhausted. So I probably haven't picked up the camera very often because I've just been so tired and literally most days I felt like a zombie barely functioning. I was so tired. And now I'm rested up. I feel great. I have more energy. So sleep and a nice bed, a good quality mattress, makes such a huge difference. I know they say to replace the bed every so often. It was well overdue. You're having back pain. You're not sleeping well. It could just be the mattress. So um, anyways, um, like I said, none of this is sponsored, but I just want to show you my bed. So, so without further ado, I'm going to camera around and show you. Hopefully you'll be able to like see it raise up and I'll show you. But and hope everybody's having a good day. You know, it's almost Easter. I'm really excited for Easter and we're getting into doing all these fun things for the kids. Um, picked up a bunch of um, little Easter activities and, you know, coloring eggs. We always look forward to that. Um, and then in Minnesota, of course, we are going to be getting dumped on today with snow. This evening, we're supposed to be getting a lot of snow. Again, um, big surprise, but it's Minnesota, so I'm not even surprised. Um, anyways, that's what we've been doing. So uh, welcome. If you're new to my channel, I know I saw a couple new subscribers. And thank you so much for subscribing. I'm trying to hit 100 subscribers. I know that's not a lot, but for me, that would be amazing to just hit 100 subscribers. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, like, and subscribe. And if, you, and if you're new here and you have subscribed to my channel and you're new, welcome. My name is Carissa. If you haven't watched my other videos, I am a homeschool mom to two boys and it really means a lot to us. So anyways, I'm going to show you my bed. I hope everybody has a great day. So another thing that is coming up is my son's birthday. This is my youngest son. He is going to be 10 years old. I can't believe how quickly the years fly by. Definitely not ready for my kids to get any older. I'm in no rush. But anyways, my youngest, Jace, he's going to be 10 years old and he's been wanting this for a while. So so he's been wanting and asking for this transformer. I don't know anything about transformers, but my husband picked it out. I, I know he also wanted a Sonic stuffed animal. So I ordered that and a few other things. Mom is treating to dinner for his birthday and they've been wanting to see the new Mario Brothers movie that is coming out. So my mom is also treating for that. So I'm really excited. I'm, it's kind of bittersweet, but I'm excited for him. So waiting for these gifts to be delivered and then we will wrap them all, but I'm excited. But first, let me show you the bed. Hope you're able to actually see it adjusting. I'm not really sure if you're gonna be able to see it, but we're gonna try. So I'm adjusting it up. Goes pretty high. Okay, so I'm going to show you my bed sheets because they're really comfortable. So anyways, I'm going to show you. So I just have this blanket here. This is for a queen, so I will get a king size at some point. These are the bed sheets. This is the pattern, and they're really soft. But I had one of these big foam things to put on the bed, and it was good for about a month. And then it was awful. It was terrible, so that was a big waste of money. I think that was over $100 too. Um, I do not recommend that at all. So that's my king size bed.